Barbara Simons. Shedding Light on Dogma. I am the way the truth and the life and no one comes to the Father but by me. Jesus is talking about the way to the Father. Not the way to heaven. But Christianity has morphed this into something it is not. Saved doesn't mean to be spared from torture in eternal flames. Or to gain entrance into heaven. Saved means that we are no longer mortal. The Father is not a man with a white beard sitting on a throne somewhere up in a place called heaven with streets of gold. The Father is a concept. A creative principle. The source of everything within all that is activated by the frequency that manifests when we love. The pattern that was Jesus. Exhibited and manifested the supernatural dimension because this creative principle was at his disposal. Always. The Father. And it is likewise with us when we choose to love rather than to separate and to judge. As humans, we tend to anthropomorphize God. Which means to ascribe human attributes. And it is impossible for God is not human. Neither is Satan. Satan is also a principle of contraction that binds energy efficiently in matter, although that is an article for another day. Or you may read chapter 4 in the book titled The Third Millennium by Ken Carey for a more superior view of this principle and its role in creation. So, to summarize, the creative principle, the progenitor from whence all things come is within you but is not accessible when we remain as darkened humans running around the earth with egocentric dictated wanderings. Once the ego has chosen to deny selfishness and is crucified. Yes, that is the meaning to that pattern. And resurrected as servant to the eternal part of our identity. May we access that creative principle within. Our role is to willingly surrender our ego. Step into love and our inheritance as creator of the multiverse and to complete the school of earth and the lessons found therein. Yours is a big story. Step out of your limited views and see from above, not from below.